You know, inspection of parts and assembly line applications, it can be difficult. Uh, machine vision, camera systems, even conventional human visual inspection, it's easy to look at things in Cartesian coordinates, but how do you look around corners? How do you peek inside hidden areas where a critical component may be missing or not installed correctly, perhaps a hole not tapped or something not drilled? I'm with Nick McDonald, he's business development application manager ABB Inc. And Nick, we're standing in front of an inspection system which is robotic, which gets around some of those limitations. Some of the challenges that you just mentioned with uh, vision inspection, this seemed to really good fit. I mean, it's got cameras built into the hands. With the UMI, we can actually put the camera exactly where you need, as close as you need. Um, the other thing is that because it is a built-in vision system, we send this information off to a PC. You can gather that information, throw it into an Excel spreadsheet. So you're getting the, the photograph of the, the shot. You're getting the timestamp of when it was taken. It works because it's, because it's got the two arms and because it is collaborative. And Nick, I noticed that in this particular application, your sample here is this, uh, this is a double overhead cam cylinder head, uh, it's a Ford part. This is sort of a, of a classic inspection problem. You have deep recesses inside this part. You have tiny components, things like keepers on uh, on yep. pallets for, for the valves on the inside. Yep. Now, uh, in my experience, automotive uh, of, of tier one OEMs, is that it's possible to have a part missing or absent, or That's misinstalled, correct. a hole not threaded, something not tapped. Uh, and it's very difficult, with even with a, a good machine vision system, to discern that in a moving, fast-moving application. And if this gets through and gets assembled into an engine, I mean, you have a, you have a yeah, serious problem. Yeah, it's a big problem. problem. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, especially because it's it's near the end of the processing of the part. This, this particular application here, we're looking at 152 uh, different separate points. So we're looking for uh, missing bolts. We're looking for uh, to make sure that the holes have been drilled. We're looking for. We're even looking for casting marks or locating uh, marks as well. So we can do that whole inspection one go. Yeah. Now look at this, imagine from, um, going back up the chain of design perspective, it sounds to me like perhaps you don't need to necessarily design in a window or open up a hole to allow conventional inspection. If you can literally reach into a recess and peek into a, a large casting or something like that. This one here was kind of a no-brainer for some of our customers that looked at this and said, well, I know exactly what I want to do with this. Mm -hmm. I know that I can get in close and get some of these things. Mm -hmm. Is this expensive technology? Is this restricted to, to OEMs? Do you have to be Toyota or no, no, Volkswagen no. To, to, to go? No, the uh, price point is actually pretty good. So we're looking at about 40K for the unit itself, the, the vision system. So mm -hmm. it's more than reasonable, considering it is collaborative. You don't need the fencing. You don't need the safety PLC. There are no light curtains. There are no scanners. None of that stuff's needed. So you're saving there. Automated collaborative part inspection from ABB.